Okay, let's fix a FPS drop in the finals game. First, go to device manager. Next, disable uh, everything that you are not using for, like example, uh, Bluetooth in here. Disable it. If you are not sure uh, what this thing do, like that, uh, don't disable it. So next, uh, go under uh, software devices, uh, disable uh, Microsoft Device Association root enumerator. If you are using like uh, printers and like all devices like that, uh, don't disable it. Next, uh, Microsoft TS Wave Table Synth. Uh, you are into like mu uh, music production like that, uh, using music devices uh, connected to your computer, then don't disable it. Next, uh, under system devices. Uh, disable composite bus enumerator uh, like the before same thing uh, if you're using printers uh, NS and MIDI devices don't disable it uh, next uh, high pression event timer disable it they say that uh, it is useful for time sensitive operations uh, but disabling it uh, will help the game run smoother okay uh, next, uh, disable a remote desktop uh, device redirector bus. After that, go to uh, Universal Serial Bus Controllers. For each uh, device in here, right click it, go to Properties, Power Management, untick this and click OK. Then close the window. Go to uh, Traffic Settings. If you not see uh, the finals game in here, go to browse, select the discovery.txt, click add, go to the options, select high performance and click save. After that, uh, go to change uh, default graphics settings, untick these options. Uh, actually, you can uh, try in, uh, turning on these options if you want. Uh, turning off these settings uh, help me a lot to run the game smoother. Next, uh, search game mode and uh, turn it on and close it. Next, search adjust the appearance and performance of Windows. Select custom, tick only these two options, click OK. Uh, next, uh, we should uh, choose uh, ultimate performance power plan. Click search, search power plan, uh, choose a power plan. You will see, normally you will see a uh, balanced high performance and power saver option. High performance is okay. You can select it if you want. If you haven't uh, enabled ultimate performance option, you will not see it in here. So let's enable it. Uh, search uh, ultimate performance power plan command in uh, Google. Copy down this uh, command. I'll drop this command in the description too. So you can copy it. Search uh, CMD. Right click. Run as administrator, paste it, press enter. I have already added it. Uh, so, next, uh, go to power options and select the ultimate performance option. Okay, next thing is uh, we should uh, enable exclusive full screen mode for this game to run smoother. So, search registry editor click yes and this is the path uh, go to hk account user next system game config store children after go to children uh, search find search discovery and find next if you have searched correctly the game, uh, you will see the matched X full path 
as the path to the directory of the uh, final scheme in your device. Uh, next, double click on flags. Default this value, I think uh, it's like 11 or something. So change it to 211. Click OK. Okay. Next, uh, go to NVIDIA control panel. Adjust image settings with preview. Select the second option. Go to manage 3D settings. Program settings. Hit the final scheme to here if you not seen the final scheme in here. Click add. Browse. Go to wherever you have installed the final scheme and select the discovery.txe and click open. You can copy my settings. Oh, one thing uh, you shouldn't use uh, ultra for the low latency mode, it will cause some issues. Go to adjust desktop size and version. Uh, if you are using like custom uh, stretch resolutions, uh, don't choose noise scaling. Uh, you have to choose full screen but i highly suggest do not use custom uh, stretch resolution use native resolution so if you are using native resolution click noise scaling perform scaling on display tick this apply and i highly suggest uh, don't use uh, chasing for the final scheme Disable it and uh, run the game and see how it feels. Uh, because uh, enabling G-Sync will cause some input latencies. So, yeah, you can try it out. If you have all computer, all generation computer, uh, I think uh, you should go to your mouse settings. Like if you are using Logitech or Flores, whatever, Razor, or whatever. Go to the mouse setting and change polling rate to 500. You will not see any difference, uh, just uh, it will help to run the game smoother because uh, selecting 1000 uh, polling rate sometimes uh, causes uh, FPS drops. Uh, next, we are going to clean NVIDIA cache. Uh, first, go to uh, NVIDIA control panel. Then uh, go to manage 3D settings. In here, you will see uh, shader cache size. Uh, there's an option uh, disabled. So select the disabled option, then click apply. Uh, after applying, you have to restart your computer. completing that uh, type run and then type percentage local app data percentage click ok then in here you will find nvidia folder go to gl cache and select all and uh, press shift delete and click yes Next, go to C drive, users, your username, and then go to app data. This is a hidden folder, so if you can't see it in here, uh, go to view and show and click hidden items, and you can see app data. Then go to local low in NVIDIA driver version dx cache and again press ctrl a and select all and 
uh, shift delete uh, and click yes uh, in here you uh, will get a pop-up like uh, saying file in use so in that case uh, tick do this for all current items and skip in search type disk cleanup select c drive click ok and uh, clean up system files again ok select all and click ok then again type run type percentage temp percentage click ok select all shift delete yes and if any pop-ups comes up that saying file in use uh, tick do this for all current items and skip next again type run type temp press ok select all shift delete then again in run type tree fetch and uh, you will see a pop-up uh, to ask in a permission admin permission uh, click continue and again press alt a and select all the items and shift delete and click yes and yeah you will get uh, a pop-up uh, message that say in file in use so in that case again tick uh, do this for all current items and skip okay after doing uh, all these things uh, again go to uh, nvidia control panel manage 3d settings before you are uh, restart the computer you have selected uh, the disable option so again you have to uh, select uh, driver default option and click apply if you are interested in seeing more tips in future please subscribe and happy gaming